this video we are going to see how to update angular applications like uh, if your application is running in uh, angular 11 version you can update it to angular 12 then update it to angular 13 so angular recommends updating like one one major versions not um, multiple versions together so it will go one by one so here in my case i have a application with angular 12 i want to update it to angular 13 so for that uh, before that uh, make sure your uh, global cli is angular uh, 13 above so that uh, it will install angular 13 into our application so let me start with the steps so here uh, you need to type npx great If you see uh, we got an error the repository is not clean please commit a stash so to fix or to overcome this error you need to uh, iphone iphone allow dirty and then iphone iphone force so this will uh, fix this one and also uh, here uh, what happens here is so when you click uh, npx angular cli at the rate that will install a temporary version of angular 13 inside this folder because we have uh, angular 13 uh, sorry angular 12 version so this will not able to install the uh, latest version of angular so uh, we need to first uh, install a temporary angular cli so here npx will be install the temporary and then later we are updating the angular core and also the angular cli so this is what we are doing here so let me enter it now We got error uh, socket timeout, but if you look at here, uh, our application got already updated. Uh, let me check you once again. Okay, so this time uh, the migration has been successfully completed. But if you look at our package.jsr, it's updated with uh, 13 versions. That is good, right? But uh, here, Angular CDK is in 12, and the Angular Material is still in 12. So, if you use Angular Material, we need to uh, do one more steps as well. Uh, okay, so here, um, so you know, right? Uh, to iPhone, iPhone allow uh, dirty and iPhone, iPhone force. Uh, is used when we have any dependency issues or any repository clean issues at the time you need to specify these two okay so now let me update at the rate angular slash material at the rate 13 this will now uh, update angular material angular material um, angular animation and uh, cdk all those stuff all those stuff okay so now angular material also upgraded now so if you see if you see angular cdk version is updated and also angular material version also updated so this is how we update angular application from uh, one major version into another major version like now here from angular 12 to 13 if you want to update from angular 11 to 13 you can't uh, directly update from angular 11 to direct uh, to 13 so angular suggests always uh, update one by one one by one major versions from angular 11 to angular 12 then angular 12 to angular 13 so and uh, if you want to uh, see the guidelines uh, provided by angular then this is the best place where you can uh, see all the 
updates for angular like so if you want to update from angular 12 to 13 so here it is but here if you use uh, angular material in your application you need to check this out and then uh, you have to do the two steps so this is how we did so first of we did and then the second step but if you want to update from angular 11 to 13 see uh, this is a warning they don't support uh, major versions at once so uh, you have to go one by one so from 11 then you have to go to 12 then after that so for 12 you need to do like this so which version you want to update you want to uh, specify that version so here okay uh, now let us run our application and test it okay so without any issues our application has started successfully let us go to localhost port to double zero and check okay so here the basic uh, template created by the angular 